Hey, let me ask you a question. Are, are you just kind of over Zoom? Are you done with Zoom? Are you Zoomed out? I'm not a big fan of Zoom, so what I've been doing is looking for alternatives, and I've got four alter... That'd be eight. I have four alternatives that I want to share with you that you could be using right now instead of Zoom. <laughs> Hey, I'm Kevin Colby, and I love helping people like you share your passion and impact the world with online video and marketing. If that sounds cool, hit that subscribe button, and let's get into it. Hey, between you and me and the whole interwide web, I'm not a fan of Zoom. In fact, I rarely use Zoom unless I'm in a meeting and somebody invites me to it. So, if you're kind of like that, and you're just done with Zoom, or you're just looking for an alternative to Zoom, here are four sites I want to recommend. Google Meet. Now, look, besides being backed by Google, that's the name Google Meet, <laughs> it, it's built right into the Google Calendar. So if you're scheduling a call or a presentation or something like that, it's really easy just to click it and make it a meeting. So Google Meet is free. You can also share your screen, which is huge if you're doing an online class or a course or a presentation. You can have unlimited meetings. That's right, there's no cap on how many meetings you can have. You can even record meetings and you can have up to 100 people. I don't even know if I know that many people. Another option is StreamYard. Now StreamYard is a very basic live streaming and recording platform. It lives all in the cloud. It's easy to use. They have free plans and they have paid plans. You have the ability to share your screen even on the free plan and you can have up to six People. Another option is Blue Jeans. Now, Blue Jeans has a lot of plans, and I think the cheapest plan starts around 12 bucks a month. You can have unlimited meetings, which is always huge. You can share your screen, and you can have up to 50 people. And another option, Ecamm Live. And of all of these, Ecamm Live is my absolute favorite and my go-to. I use Ecamm Live for live streaming and recording a lot of videos too. Now, Ecamm Live has a 14-day free trial, and if you're interested, there's a link down in the description. You could try it and see if you like it. They have two paid plans after that, and you get some different things. With Ecamm Live, you can live stream to any platform, and you can also record only. It is super simple to record your screen. In fact, I use Ecamm Live to do all of my picture-in-picture -picture tutorials that I do. Ecamm Live integrates perfectly with Stream Deck, which is just a little device. You'd have to buy that extra, but it's just a little device that allows you to set up scenes and, and actually kind of take control like a little production unit. And another really cool thing about Ecamm Live is for a lot of cameras, mirrorless and DSLRs like my Canon M50, you can use it like a webcam using just the USB cable. So four very strong alternatives, and they all have pros and cons, a lot more pros than I think Zoom does. Let me know in the comments which one of these alternatives to Zoom that you want to use or you liked best, or is there one I didn't mention either? Hey, I'm Kevin. Thanks for watching. See you on the tube.